Right now I'm outside the Armed Forces Recruitment Center. Um, I'm not very, I'm prior service, but I'm not very pro-military. My views have changed quite a bit, but with this situation that's going on with the people that are on me, um, I no longer have much of a choice. So this is going to be my temporary option just to get them off of me and bring in some type of source of income. Now, I did make an attempt back in, I don't know, I want to say the middle of, the middle of 2015 to rejoin, to rejoin for a short while and it was odd it was the oddest experience because I started everything I started the process with the paperwork I needed to bring back in the NGB 22 or NG whatever 22 and um and I never heard back from them I never heard back from the recruiter now that's something that you never hear a recruiter will always get in touch with you. Primary, secondary, phone number, they'll find a way to get a hold of you. They'll even show up most of the time. But I got so caught up doing other things that I really didn't give it much thought until these last couple of days when I've been considering rejoining and um, those, the ties that are looking in on me are making comments about keeping me from joining the military because this man does not want me to be able to join some apparently when I'm in the military he loses track of me so I'm gonna go in here and finish up this process and see how much difficulty I have so this is part one